And we shift our focus to some other news that we are tracking very closely is where a five-judge bench of the Supreme Court headed by the Chief Justice of India will hear a set of petitions seeking legal recognition of the same-sex marriages. The top court will hear at least 15 to 20 petitions demanding legalization and the legal recognition for the same-sex marriages and other rights availed to the married couples in the country. Now, this hearing comes after details of Centre's affidavit to the top court came out where the Centre has strongly opposed the pleas calling the same-sex marriage as an urban elitist concept. Centre also termed marriage as an exclusively heterogeneous institution. Well, this is going to be significant as the Centre has, in a strong-worded manner, put forth its objection on the same-sex marriage. And to get us more details, I'm joined by Harish on the phone line. Well, Harish, good morning. This is going to be significant as the top court is all uh, set to hear the 15 to 20 petitions on same-sex marriage. But what is interesting is that this comes after the centre has made it amply clear about its position on the opposing the same-sex marriages. What is expected today in the court then? Yes, uh, good morning. Uh, as you rightly put, a uh, very big day as far as the raging debate over the uh, legalization of uh, same-sex marriage in the country is concerned. A five-judge bench led by the Chief Justice of India, D.Y. Chandrachud, will at 10.30 a.m. Uh, commence a hearing on a batch of petition which have sought uh, legalization of uh, same-sex marriage uh, uh, in the country. And very significantly, this hearing, the all-important hearing, will be live-streamed uh, from the Supreme Supreme Court website uh, for the benefit of uh, the public uh, and those who are interested in this issue. Uh, remember, the petitioners had uh, argued that uh, the Special Marriage Act is ultra-virus of the Constitution of India to the extent that it discriminates between same-sex couples and opposite-sex couples, denying same-sex couples both legal rights as well as the social recognition and status that flow from the marriage. They also argue that uh, the Supreme Court has always protected the right of intercaste and interfaith couples to marry a person of their choice. Uh, and uh, at the same time, as you rightly put, uh, the center as an effort of its principally cited the Indian sanskar, societal morality and Indian ethos centuries-old culture and traditional uh, tradition where only biological male and biological female can marry and uh, said uh, that uh, the same-sex marriage is against uh, the uh, uh, against societal morality and the Indian ethos. It is a elitist, elitist uh, urban concept far away from the Indian uh, and not suited to the Indian culture and, uh, and morality. Uh, it has, uh, uh, in fact, uh, uh, the, 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 the center has also said that legislative understanding of marriage of the, in the Indian statutory and personal law regime refers only to a marriage between a biological man and a biological woman, and any interference would cause a complete havoc with the delicate balance of personal laws in the country and in accepted societal values. The center has also frowned upon the same-sex marriage while invoking the accepted view that a marriage between a biological man and woman is a holy union sacrament and right. the sanskar in India and same-sex marriage no, is not in conformity with societal morality and Indian ethos. Very significantly, the center has also said that this is a policy yes. matter and Supreme Court should not interfere and only the center can decide on the issue by uh, holding discussion with stakeholders like uh, urban and rural uh, population and for study, after studying personal laws and, uh, and the views of the various religious de denominations. Absolutely, and Harish. Center has Centra said that first, Supreme Court should decide on the maintainability of the petitions before going into the merits. And we shall be getting the, all the updates from the Supreme Court as the entire hearing of the petition is going to be live-streamed, as mentioned by my colleague Harish. Thank you for getting us all those details. We shall come back to you as and when the matter comes up in the Supreme Court.